Good morning everybody. How are you? My prospection is that all of you are fine. Today I discuss one important topic from you science subjects. Their title is combustion and fuel. First time I say to you that what is combustion? Combustion is a process, the burning of any substance or materials in the presence of oxygen is known as combustion. Which gas is must need to combustion? That is oxygen. Okay. You also know that what is fuel? A combustible materials which is used to maintain fire is an example oil, natural gas, wood, etc. In order to create that is heat or power. Something gives the nourishment of food. It is known as fuel. Okay. Today I go to the point access stand question number 5 give reasons. Number A Water is not used to control fires involving electrical equipments. When you read the story or tale of this chapter, you know that water is a good conductor of electricity. Okay. Then you also uh, know of, or you have an idea that if we add it to an electric fire, the water must be spread the electricity further. And any person dousing the fire might get an electric shock. Due to this, water is not a good um, materials to use for controlling the uh, fires of electrical equipments. Now I start to write the points. Number one, we know that water is a good conductor of electricity. City. Okay, what is conductor? Conductor means which helps to conveying or transporting the electric. As like as water is a good conductor or materials which help to conveying the electric. Okay, due to this we cannot use uh, water to control the electric fire. Then I go to the point that is number two. If we add it to an electrical fire, water, water must spread through the electric city and further the fire is increases. If we add it water, then Water, this is the sign of or symbol of sign of water is to O. Water would just spread that electric electric fire further. Okay, due to this this, uh, uh, this we cannot use the water to control electrical fire. Now I go to another point. The person dousing the fire might get what? Electric shock. Number three. The person the person dousing D-O-U-S-I-N-G dousing the fire okay might get 
क्वार्ट शॉक इलेक्ट्रिकल शॉक This is so much painful shock. Now I said to you that the person dousing the fire might get electrical shock. S H O C K. What is dousing? Dousing means shock. Sorry, dousing means ha huh, shock. Uh, that is S O A K. Now I said to you again that why? Why? What is the reasons that we cannot use as the water as a good materials to control the electrical fire? First point is water is a good conductor of electricity, which help to conveying the electricity. Um, that means conductor means to support to carry or transport the electric. Uh, number two point that is if we added water. In higher electric fire, water would just spread electric fire further. It, then it help to fire to increasing, not to stopping the burning stop electric equipments. Due to this, we can't use the uh, water as a uh, materials to control the electric fire. Then the other point is the person dousing the fire might get electric shock. Due to three reasons, we can't use the water as an extinguisher to control electric fire. My prospection is that all of you get an idea and also you are be careful when any electric fire is occur or happen in your home, your, your surroundings, then you can't use the water as a material to control the electrical fire in electrical equipment okay thank you so much and i have uh, faith that all of you get this idea clear idea from my discussion see you again in our next class tata -ta.